it looks rather large very quirky full renovation project it definitely looks like a place that could have chickens so exciting i can't wait to show you this one So you'd open all this up and have one big kitchen, wouldn't you? Yeah. One big living floor. There is possibility for a deal because it is in an inheritance. You never told me that part. Welcome to my channel. I'm Fern, proud mum of two and wife to husband Ryan. We took a huge risk leaving our hometown in the north of England to the stunning French Riviera. It has been one crazy journey with some super challenging times, but the highs definitely make it all worthwhile and we've discovered parts of ourselves we never knew existed. Subscribe and join me for a peek into my daily life living on the French Riviera. Brand new video, welcome back everybody. I'm with Ryan today. We're actually just in the car, squeezing in a house viewing. We love the house viewings, they get very tedious, very time consuming. We don't really give them much thought anymore. Like I used to get excited before viewings and really think about them and scrutinize the pictures and things. Whereas now I book them in and it's like, ooh, we need to get ready, we need to go to the house viewing. They're, they're quite like life disturbing if I'm honest. The novelty's worn off. Um, I'm sure you're as bored as we are with the viewings. But then again, looking at my analytics, you seem to quite like these videos. So I thought I'd keep sharing them with you. Why keep you in the dark if you enjoy seeing these properties? And today's looks rather interesting if I'm honest. It's very... French. It's actually classed as a Bastide, which is lovely. Um, it looks rather large, very quirky, full renovation project, which we don't mind taking on at all, but there just has to be some love, some quirk, some charm or something that makes us like excited to take it on and give, or, give it our like time and expense and things um so yeah taking you along to see the bastide it's not got a pool it's much more of like a farmy kind of property um the only kind of bad thing that i can pick out straight away is the location i don't know exactly where it is the um owners wouldn't disclose the address which is really common when you're doing viewings uh, they don't give you the address. They just like to get you there, you know, because a lot of people obviously drive up to the property first and judge it on where it is and whatever. Um, so, yeah, not a location that we've kind of wanted to be in. But then again, we'll give it a chance. We'll check the street. It all depends on what the street's like, the surroundings like, because you always have to drive anyway, living here in the mountains. You have to get in your car all the time. So it doesn't really matter we'll see the shutters look like they need changing color possibly to pink or something <laughs> uh, what do you think hon it looks lovely doesn't it to be fair it looks like a really old it's solid an 18th century ma or mass mass i thought it was a bastide it's a bastide it's the same thing oh it's a mass and a bastide the same i don't know if it's mass or is it ma you never know with the french are they going to mm. pronounce that last letter or are they not it's big um like i said it's quite farmy and yeah it just looks like a really well built solid property which yeah it's got whatever. six bedrooms has it hmm. six i wonder if some of them are quite small and an annex oh wow i, I, didn't know that. I think it's 230 square meters plus an annex Ooh guys yeah it could be too big that's and, exciting well, and do you know what i've got a little bit more of it insider info yes there is a possibility for a deal because it is in an inheritance you never told me that part yeah well i only found out yesterday or something like that see this is what i mean we're too busy we're, we're just doing so busy. we're just like 
we've got a viewing let's get in the car let's go the real like the proper life disturbers yeah um, they are life disturbers <laughs> i was literally in the middle of doing um ordering materials for a job that we're starting in two weeks time so but yeah. we've just got to keep ticking and keep rolling so ticking and rolling yeah <laughs> Um, so exciting! I can't wait to show you this one. Even if it's a no, it should be really lovely to look around. And maybe one of you guys will want to buy it anyway. So yeah, maybe. Mm -hmm. uh, we want commission if you do. Of course, don't forget the <laughs> referral. It definitely looks like a place that I could have chickens. I'm like desperate for chickens. You know what? The other week we went up to a location um, with Rise Work. And there was like a little market on selling all fresh produce and we bought some eggs okay we bought a few boxes of these eggs I got them home and they had a stamp on them from the day before that's how fresh they were they'd been collected the day before and oh my what a difference you could actually taste in these eggs not funny not funny oh Darling. my gosh so childish <laughs> He's putting the fart noises on in the car. I was not, that was you with your bottom. I think it's such a huge gimmick having this fart thing. It so it? is, yeah. <laughs> it so is a gimmick. But I couldn't help myself. Anyway. As I said in the previous vlog where um, Ryan's hiring, this is his new hire car at the moment. It's a Tesla and it's got all the gadgets and stuff on the screen at the front. Anyway, um, these chicken eggs, honestly, they were so creamy and so buttery and you could actually taste the difference oh to be able to get your own eggs every day just they were just covered chicken. in mud as well weren't they, they? were yeah covered just dead mud. rustic had straw on them a few feathers yeah love it anyway it's the life in it that's the life it is. got your own chickens living off your land yeah. i'd need at least eight because i eat four eggs a day mm. yeah and you eat two and kids might have two okay okay yeah okay we're we're arriving okay right away Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye. I don't know where they are. Don't know where she is. Anyway, look. Are you sure they said McDonald's? Yeah, she said McDonald's. So this is what um, they do. The estate agents often ask you to meet somewhere and then you follow and drive them to the property, which is what we're doing. So we're just waiting for her. Marie Claire, who's lovely. We've had a viewing with her before. Um, come on then, back to the, the horn sounds. So shall we play? So what we got? This is a new another horn. Not loud enough for me. Goat. I love goats. Let's listen to that one. I want to hear the goat. Not loud enough. You really wanted to La do Cucaracha. that. Cucaracha. <laughs> I want that one. That's good. That's good because it's loud. It? We're having that one. So when someone comes and you go, Oi! Oh. But I don't think they'd hear that after. Who would? Oh, that guy's looking over there, look. He's looking. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> I'm sorry, my car farted. <laughs> Should I make Do it again? again? Wait there, wait there, wait oh. there. Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> now that's the kind of gadgets I'm interested in. Ones I can have real fun with, with strangers. Yeah, actually, I'm down for that. <laughs> I'm sold, honestly. I really like this estate agent who's showing us around today. She's so lovely. So lovely. And she kind of gets what we want as well. She understands, so she doesn't just like bombard us with everything and anything she literally sends us like the look that we want yeah and i just really get good vibes from my dear mm -hmm. Dad. yeah so um a selection of each yeah okay no problem all right we're on it now all Thanks. right see you later bye 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 it's quieter here isn't it yes this bit seems a little bit built up. Oh, there's a police station. Is that a police station? That's yep. good. Surely no one would rob you around here then. I don't think they would actually. It's quite built up. Wow.
as to price. <laughs> Cheap as chips. Two square meters. Two yeah. cellars. Oh my gosh, what's down there then? Right, shall I have a look? Oh gosh, there looks to be some creepy parts. It's like a little uh, storage a storage room. Oh, Look, it's oh, got it a door at the, the other side. Yeah. So what we got? Oh. bedrooms everywhere because they, okay. they need enough room. They yes. Have here. Okay. Mm -hmm. so, but it can be. Well, you used to renovations, don't you? Oh, yeah, <laughs> so right. you can see the potential of the, exactly, uh, yeah. of the house. Yeah, yeah. Needs to total refurbishment. Huh? Of course. Guest room. Guest room. Ouais, c'est là. Vraiment, c'est normal. Là, ici, on donne dans les dans les garage, cave. Là. Garage. Attends, on va allumer. Oh, c'est là. Uh, garage, cellars, oh. all the extras yeah. of the house, oh. but you can, oh. you can convert it. Oh gosh, oh look at all the paperwork and everything. Mm. It looks at home. Oh wow. 65 square meters. Yeah. Oh, hello, Golden. The Smells like an antique shop. Mm -hmm. It is. It's like a brocom. Oh. More storage, wow. Oh, yes. Oil, oil heating. Oil heating. I need the lights on, just so you want to go around. All the floor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. The living the living area. Yeah. The kitchen. Ah, wow. The sitting room. Ah, okay. Dining. Oh, it's a sympa, fireplace, sympa. Oh, it's a <laughs> En fin de compte, d'origine, la maison c'est salle à manger, séjour, cuisine et on a encore une Ah oui, ils ont fait une grande chambre. Oui, mais ça peut tout se repenser. Ça. Oui, 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 parce que euh, mm. ils avaient besoin d'avoir une chambre. Il, il, il faut faire des travaux, mais c'est intéressant. Ah, ouais. C'est intéressant. Très intéressant. Nice area here. Yeah, this yeah. is nice. And much light. Nice. One of the first houses here. Must be sold all in land. Ah. Whoever had this, you know? Because all the older houses are newer, aren't they? Maybe it was the only the only house here. Yeah, yeah. I think so. Yeah. Because you have a small two-story building just behind the house. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Yeah, yeah but yeah, the one one. Oh, I bet it did. Ah, the one. Oh, yeah, I don't on it as well. Or oh, do you access that somewhere that's else? The, the, maybe that's the thing from the other side. Ah, okay. Oh! Oh! Oui. Oh gosh, it just goes on and on. How many bedrooms? Oh, what's this? Oh, yeah. Wow, that's lovely, but. And then all this, so everything, single room needs it, I'm just saying. Fences. Hi, ceilings. You'd have to drop the ceiling though. Why? Slightly. Why? To put the AC system in. You'd have to drop it by that angle. So you'd open all this up and have one big kitchen, wouldn't you? Yeah. One big living floor. For the kids, for the kids, for the kids, for the kids, for the the only for the kids. Ouais, for kids. Yeah. Can I go up? Yeah, I got you. It's Gosh, it's just Attic. huge. Attic, no? Attic. Oh my gosh. Never ends. Is that all open then up there? What is it? Oh gosh, look how creepy that is. There's a creepy attic. Oh gosh. That is creepy, I can feel draft. What's up there? Let me see. It's just how you get into the things. Ooh. Oh god, you would be scared in here when you open it, yeah. Ooh. Cool. Ooh. It's insulated. That's the tiniest bath I've ever seen in my life. Look at that. That's a dog, that's a dog bath. <laughs> yeah, that's not a bath. It's a very big house. And the entrance looks like a little castle. I know. Hmm? I know. Where is a castle? <laughs> King Charles II home. It's very the French Riviera. Yes, 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 no? Yeah. <laughs> 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 This floor never ends. Gosh, it's like... <laughs> this one never ends. Like. No. Oh. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's a toilet. Ah, yeah. What are you doing in there? It's a toilet. Never. Another little toilet. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ah, oh. Oh, so that's where the stairs Voila. come up to. Okay, I understand. A separate apartment. Oh, Scottish <laughs> carpet! <laughs> it is! Right. <laughs> 
Donc là, ils ont vraiment fait un dortoir, mais c'est pas du tout les. What you inspecting? Just an effect of story. Ça a été, ouais, ça a été. Euh... Bonnie, là. Big attic. Ouais. More, more. More? Ouais. It is definitely interesting. It's quite cosy, isn't it? You could make it quite cosy, even though it's so big. You know. I don't think they'll take what I don't think they'll take what I don't think I know you'd have to put in a seriously low offer, wouldn't you? Because it's just a money eater. I'd want to rip everything down and everything out. All the electrics need redoing. Yeah, of course. Needs everything redoing. All the electrics need redoing. Yeah, of course. Needs air conditioning everywhere. Yeah. Gosh, look at all the things. So sad, isn't it? So much personal things everywhere. Hairs all over the place. It was so windy at that property because it was right at the top of a hill, so the winds were like major. Um, but wow, 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 wow. That was what, interesting, what was it? wasn't it? It certainly was. That was very interesting, guys. I For the right price, I'd have bought it. Yeah. Do you know, the work doesn't scare me. The only thing I was really put off by, to be honest, is something that you can't change, and that was the properties surrounding it there was lots of parts of it that were overlooked and lacked privacy which is a real shame um what had happened is it's obviously a a mass of bastide so it originally had a lot of land with it it's still got a lot of land with it but it had a lot more and parts of the land had been sold off so properties have been built i mean one of the buildings was i'm sure it was flats one day Mm -hmm. um, yeah, it was definitely flats. Behind, uh, which put me off massively because, yeah, it was tons of work. But if I was going to give my energy and time to that, I'd want to be private. I'd want it to be so private. I want to go out in the garden in my, dre in my dressing gown in the morning and feed my chickens and not think that somebody's looking out the window, you know. I just want ultimate privacy. Um, and as big as it was, it was so big. But weirdly, I still felt like it was like had coziness about it and had like a family, like cozy feeling, which sometimes is really hard to get on big overwhelming properties. Um, so yeah, could have been nice, could have been a really, really interesting project. It's just those other properties that really put me off, which is a shame because parts of it I loved. What about you, hon? Uh, yeah, the right price. 
the right price. Which was way less than the asking. Just because of the amount of work. There's, yeah. there's a ton of money to sink into it. Absolutely. It'd have been nice, but yeah. Yeah, and you know what? I wouldn't have rushed to do it as well. I would have obviously started at the top, work your way down, just try and make it. You live and learn, don't you? I wouldn't rush through anything like that anymore when it's living in it for you. You know, it wouldn't be a flipper or anything. Shame. Such a shame. She knows what we want. She's on the right vibe and I love her. Mm -hmm. I really do. She's so nice, isn't she? She is. I am easily overwhelmed and weirdly, I didn't overwhelm me. I think obviously the top floor, you would create a space where it's like the master bedroom, master dressing room. You'd have your office space up there as well and main bathroom. So it'd just be like our space on the top, top floor. And then the middle floor was your main living space. So you could knock through and have big open plan, kitchen, dining room, chill section. That's what that would be. Oh gosh, look how close that is. These are crazy. Traffic's not great around here, is it? No, that's another downside. It's always busy on this bit of part of grass. Um, and then the bottom floor. I don't know if you'd be able to make two bedrooms down there. Would ideally be for the kids because now they're getting all older, they like their own privacy and that could have been their space. Um, but I don't know. I'd say it's a no. <laughs> Another no. Another no. We'll keep going though. You know yeah. what? Like I said, the right one will come along at the right time. I believe we'll be like, it as well. Yes. Yes. I believe. Hmm. Oh. What are you doing? <laughs> you thought it were me. You seriously <laughs> thought it were me. <laughs> oh, you done that? <laughs> Other side me. <laughs> You're, so... You're embarrassed. Right, shot it. <laughs> Dived over me. <laughs> It's so like, embarrassed! It's like the ultimate embarrassed kid pool, isn't it? <laughs> Did you like that? <laughs> Mom, what? we need to do it, we'll make sure it's hard. Yeah. Go yeah. Stop now, that stinks. I know. Stop stinks. it. <laughs> Sir, it's a your test face for even me. looks like you're doing it. This is what I like to see. If they see me, they'll go mad, but after school, playing football together. This is what naturally happens when we put like time lim limits on the um, gadgets. Otherwise Seth would just be straight on his like computer gaming. Um, but I just love to see them play together. I love it, she's caught me, she's caught me. Bye. <laughs>